Here's the Norwegian brand. Should yeah. we talk to them? Talk to them. Here's the owner. This is a Norwegian brand, Mikael. Is it? Yes. So we have a... I own a gym in Texas. Ah. Yes. So we're out there to look for gym equipment. Yes. I've obviously tried some of yours. This this machine, we have it in the gym in Hamar. Ah. But right. other than that, we haven't tried much. Yeah, we You're the guy of... behind the booty builder. Yes. So I invented the first heat press machine in the world. It's uh, basically here. Yeah. And uh, now it's like the... The eighth generation. Uh, so that's like the background, uh, and I'm the owner of, uh, and I own the brand, Booty Builder. Now we're at Vivo, and we're launching many new machines. This is the first time uh, we have this machine here. We have like 11 machines now. It yeah. started with like basically one machine. Now we have 11, and we're selling it. Uh, we're providing a concept called the Booty Builder Zone. So we have a dedicated uh, area in the gym where people can uh, focus on glutes and legs. So uh, do you have something new you want to show us? Uh, a lot of yeah. That we can test. Yes. Can you show them, please? Can you show? This is brand new. This is brand new. How do you use this one? Well, so I want to. Yeah. So the thing with you this. Can hold it if you want to. Well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The thing with this, I wanted to make a machine. When I go to the gym, usually all the, uh, you know, these machines, the cable machines are usually packed with uh, people trying to do other exercises. Yeah. So I want to make a. And it isn't always you can hold like this. Yeah, either. yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. So I wanted to make better flow in the gym. So I have a dedicated machine for this, and also I made the movement better. We have the feet raised. Uh, it's much easier. And start exercise. Uh, it's much smoother. It's also like made for the exercise. But yeah. uh, the point is to get more flow in the gym. And you have a dedicated piece to these different movements. All yeah. of them have like different movements. And uh, a funny thing, uh, like interesting thing, I I came up with this. I have button, uh, word button on this. Forty-five uh, Viper uh, like back extension machine. Okay. So you don't have to hold the uh, seat now, and you don't have to hold the weight plates in your hand and make a mess in the gym. Also, it takes foot, uh, less footprint. So that's my invention. Let's see. And this I have patent. You can test that one as well. This is, this is the only uh, machine on the whole expo and in the world that is a standing difference machine with weight stack. How do you use this one? That's the question. Yes. How do we use this one? You can show it. You show us. What do you think about the machine? It's good. It's good? Yeah, it's like it trusts. I like the movement. You're Norwegian as well? Swedish. Swedish? Yeah. Okay, I heard that some accent. Oh, no. I have a... Oh, no, I have the worst accent yeah, in the world, so, the so we're Norwegian. Oh. Yeah, we have Norwegian girls here, yeah. Swedish girls here, and Switzerland, from Switzerland. From Switzerland. Yeah, she's going to show. It's a standing hip post. Okay. I need to try this one myself as well to see how it is. Oh, they're posting your Instagram in chat already. Yeah. <laughs> she has a lot of followers. Uh, I have a Swedish viewer posted her uh, Instagram link okay. already. <laughs> they know how it is. Perfect. Well, so we have a new upgrade here. So we're the, this is the only bench in the world that you can uh, backrest and you can... Uh, uh, you you can show us control. instead. You can, you can show us instead. <laughs> oh, I can. I need to try some of them myself just to feel how they are. Your head. The boss doesn't want to demonstrate himself. He's sending the tired ones. <laughs> Best of two worlds. So this now she's gonna do a regular hip thrust, yeah. barbell hip thrust. So this. Uh, this is the regular one. Yeah. 
this holds the bar, so uh, the, the bar doesn't uh, roll on her uh, uh, body and uh, basically ruins her tights. Yeah. And then she is perfect. She go down. Now we're gonna do a different exercise yeah. uh, with the with the feet elevated. So, and much heavier and you have you get the more hamstring and glute activation and this is the only uh, bench in the world that you can do this in an easy way yeah, yeah. Would you, when you're doing this, like she's lying now, she has a really long distance between her legs and her upper hair. Would you say that works better than having more pushing straight up? Well, we if, you, if you put it closer. We'll do it like this. And if you, um, see what, if you, what do you think works best? I said depending on uh, if you have longer distance, it's more hamstring, shorter. Yeah. Uh, like this is uh, perfect for her. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Degree. And it, but if it goes too close, you get more quads, so you shouldn't have too close. Not too close. Either. But 90 degree is uh, more glutes. Yeah, 90 degree it's, in your legs. It's, it's 90 degrees is less hamstring. <laughs> yeah. I can try as well to see. Uh, but some people want to have some hamstring as well. Yeah. Uh, because a if, lot of... uh, if you have nice hamstring, your glutes will look better as well. Yeah. Because it's not going to look like a BBL. It's going to look like a nice body. Yeah, because it's more balanced. You don't have skinny yes. legs. So I you... need to try those two. I can try this one first. It will be in the beginning. It's quads, it feels like. No? Yeah. And when you're standing up from it, yeah. it's uh, quads. And then it pushes more over to, uh, it... to glutes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yes. Maybe if you do this. Well, you can put, you can do it. The more, more. you lean backwards, so yeah. I felt like uh, when I'm leaning. very hip dominance. Yeah. So that's for uh, and uh, you have to find the right technique to make it hit. Uh, you can hit different of uh, just there and the glutes. Yes. Yeah. But how is it? How is it heavy? No. Put it, try to put on some more. This we, can, we can put on as much as you want. Just let me know because we can add as much as weight as you want and we can also add uh, extra 60 kilo with bands. Okay. Then it, now I can feel it a little bit more. If I do like this, put on the bands, you will feel it more in the glutes. Yeah. Because it's going to be very heavy at lockout. Yeah. It's going to shake in the whole body. Because you get so much act activation. True. Yeah, it's big muscles you're using. It's so, big muscles you're using. Yeah, it's huge muscles. This one is great, and uh, you should try. Uh, that one is one of the one better because, ones. Uh, Can this just be yeah, hair balling? This is the only one that has this machine. So. We can try this as well. Two standing this way. Yeah, standing abduct abduction. How deep would so, you go? If you like sit down, yeah, sit like this, and then you lean forward a like little this? bit, and then press up. You will feel it a lot. But you can yeah. do it in many different uh, angles. Uh, you can hold here as well, but just I was yeah, to yeah, yeah. There. yeah. We have many different options to hold. This is something we need in uh, the gym. We have yeah. This is fantastic. You can do it in many different ways. You can go up and down. Yeah, you can sit. You can lean forward. But now the latest research says you're gonna lean forward and get more stretch. But there's yeah. more than one way to do it. So you would go all the way there. Maybe? Yeah, like this is like the latest research says that this is the best now. But with this, you have options to do it in all different kinds of ways. You can go up and down. You can yeah. sit. You can. So uh, that's a good thing with this. You can do it in many different ways. Many different you can ways. even stand upright. Yeah. Well. Uh, yeah. So he's going to show us how to do it now. <laughs> yes. Let the professionals do it. Well, I've never tried this. So this is the first time he's doing it. 
and we can uh, adjust that with uh, putting the bench higher yeah. but this is perfect oh there yeah and you can perform this in uh, several different ways but uh, you can arch the back if you want more like glute activation but basically this is the best way to do it because uh, now you're activating the whole posterior chain. Yeah, that feels good. Yes, this is uh, one of the best exercises, yeah. <laughs> in my opinion. For Can you adjust this one? You can adjust this in uh, any position. Okay. Put it up like this? No. no. That would be a good feature. Or because then you can it get will, even more stretch. Yeah, it's, it would be a different, but this. You get enough stretch with this one, so it works really well. It was good. Is it crazy? Like if you go for the next one. Okay, yeah. Next meeting. Okay, bye Thank bye. You for showing us. Smart picking it up. <laughs> <laughs>